Jovan, what did you feel were the key differences today? Discipline. I thought they started off in the uh, first two minutes with a penalty. We went straight back to three all. Thought we played some very good track in the first half. They got that penalty on the stroke of half time to give them a three point lead. And straight off the half time, we conceded that yellow card. And on the tenth minute of that yellow card, they scored the try. <coughs> fell behind 19, 19 points to nine. And then I think penalty count was something like 13 6. Can't concede 13 penalties in an away semi final. What do you say to the team after another semi final loss? A lot of players. What's the message of the The message is uh, we'll come back stronger next year. Firstly, review this game in the coming week. Uh, the effort and attitude I can't fault. Uh, they gave it all out there. Uh, unfortunately, we got beaten by a better team on the day. And like I said, uh, we did some really good things, but um, you can't give them 13 times that they go to a lineup from a penalty and and put you on the pressure and then you've got to defend in your own half against a quality team like Leinster. Uh, Peter, um, there seemed to be a little bit of a biting game when we saw some similar, I suppose back in December, it was a couple of afters, we saw Conor and Ross Byrne getting a bit close at one point. Um, do you feel like that rivalry has kind of stepped up again as maybe a high similar for the last few years? Yeah, what else would you expect from a, a derby? You know what I mean? There's, there's a lot at stake, semi-final. Um, uh, I wouldn't expect anything else. What's your analysis of the match, Peter? Yeah, look, similar to Johan. Um, you know, you can't come to somewhere like Leinster and see 13 penalties. Um, a lot of them in crucial moments as well, either kickable or had them under pressure in their 22. Um, and, and, you know, a big release valve when we were playing some great rugby at times. So, um, look, they certainly played very well as well. I'm, I'm not taking away from that. Uh, and their, their ability to, to keep the ball going forward. Uh, certainly for some of those penalties, you know, you're, you're under pressure you know, on your back foot, but some of them are city as well. Uh, so, sort of, <coughs> we don't have any arguments. A lot of sides would be very happy to make two semi-finals. A lot of sides don't do that, but you're doing it again and again. Does that make it more deflating or demoralizing when it's a repeat of the script, if you like, another semi-final loss? Look, we've, we've had a huge positive this year. We've, we've taken big steps for as, as have other teams, obviously. Um, you know, be different animal than me sitting here. And, you know, we were out of Europe in group stages and we uh, didn't progress in the <coughs> latter stages of this. You know, we're, we're, we're doing a lot of things right. We just got to figure out where we can get the, uh, the extra percent or two. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, then Sir Manch got that Troy Church on the ground against 40 men. What could you have done better, Monster, with your use of possession? Uh, Build more pressure. Um, got a few few penalties and um, you know, usual opportunities. I felt there in the second half there was a big, few big moments that, that charge down of, of Rory just didn't bounce up and then Joey kicked it into the corner. It rolled out. They get a five a five out line out and we can see the penalty straight away. Um, so I'm going to go back once again to discipline from from the whole group. It, it wasn't good enough on the day. And, got to finish those opportunities in a in a semi-final um, it's it's soft exits and you now we've got to take that on the chin as a coach Johan you know that you s- you can see it almost happening in front of you how vital is it that the players particularly the younger ones learn from it so you're not here again yeah we must learn from it as a group I've said from the beginning if if we lose it's it's you know it starts with the coach and we've got to be, we've got to be better um, like I said I can't fault the effort and the attitude of the players. We've got to be able as a group to, to execute under pressure and you know, it was a, a penalty literally on the stroke of half time which gave them the momentum similar to our previous semi-final and you know then the yellow card cost us 10 points. I, I thought we managed the first nine minutes of the yellow card pretty well and then literally uh, right at the end they, they got that try and then 10 points down uh, we had to play a bit more which I think we kept the ball for multiple phases but Again, the defence of Leinster, they, um, they are very good.